Hello everybody, we are back again with another box bust of Theros Beyond Death with Elspeth that I just learned with this set is actually been a brunette this whole time, I guess. I, I don't know. I, 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 it didn't occur to me. I, I Her hair was always like up under underneath something and I just didn't know. I just, I don't know. That shook my world more than anything else. <laughs> so... Still, now these are a little tighter, but they're still kind of, kind of, yeah, never mind, there it is, there it is. Okie doke, so we got in our first pack, we got Gallia, and we got Renata, in the, in the fancy treatment, still haven't found out what, what this is called, uh, we have Elspeth Conquers Death and uh, Siona. Siona's going to take a very, very specific build, isn't it? We have Nightmare Shepherd, Foil Rare. Four mana, four, four flyer. I, I mean, and then the Bronze Hide Lion and the treatment on Timoret. I like those alternate versions. We have Terranica in that one. We got Storm Herald. Storm Herald. This is our cars has nothing to do with Storm. That's okay. Get out of here, no table required. Whoa! I gotta gotta put that one in there, right? Man, those are mm. Storm's Wrath is our rare. So it looks like what those four lands, uh, about one per box. I got one in the last box, got one in this box. So uh, we'll see if that holds out to everybody else. Four Trident Wave Rider and a Grave Breaker Lamia as our rare. Protean Thermaturge? Whenever an enchantment enters the battlefield under your control, you... Oh, I, I read that yesterday because I didn't know what it was, didn't I? <laughs> yeah, it's the... I don't know. Enchantment enters the battlefield. You may... Oh, so it triggers on an enchantment, but it becomes a copy of another creature. So, it triggers on Nyxborn Ancient and becomes another copy of Nyxborn Ancient. That's what I'm hearing, right? There's Hactos. That way, you get nine times the mana. Oh, oh, I'm dropping cards. I don't know how to hold cards. Uh, we got Eidolon of Obstruction again. And let's see what we got here. Mantle of the Wolf. Caliph, I know that I'm pronouncing that wrong, I'm sure, but there's an awful lot of Tennessee in me. We have, ooh, that's a pretty thrill of possibility. I'm glad that card's back, by the way. Ooh, then, that's a Uro, because three, <laughs> one green, blue mythics with three letters are, have never gone wrong. Yeah, I'm glad I got that one. Because that's a card I really don't want to have to hunt down. We have Temple of Plenty. As that one. No specials for the uncommons. Trying to roll through this kind of quick. Uh, Thassa's Intervention. What does that one do? Put two of them in your hand and the rest on the bottom? Oh, oh Okay. So if X equals two, you just kind of not draw two. You don't trigger on things that draw, I guess. Shadow Spear. That's living the dream right there. 
equipment you never have to equip. <laughs> Heliod the Sun Crown, version number three for me. So it doesn't look like I'm going to have a hard time. I may I actually, like Heliod will probably end up going in the Daxos deck because Daxos is going to care about uh, the Devotion. I don't know if I'm going to build Heliod where it does or not. Uh, Tim Reed answers the dead, or calls the dead. <laughs> answers, calls, yeah. Um, not doing things right, am I? Words are hard. Soul Reaper of Mogus is the foil. Dream Trawler is the rare. Anax is an uncommon. That, that was a decent pack. A decent pack indeed. Uh, we have Eat to Extinction. Still got ways to go here. Uh, Dread of the Elysian Grove. We have Devour of Memory. An Underworld Breach. I don't know that I'm going to ever get too many underworld breaches. It may not be my bag. I don't know. I mean, I'll probably use it for something. But it feels like that it's just going to be a really good card. We're going to be Storyteller is the foil. Helios Intervention is the rare. Eutropa is the uncommon. That's not bad. Foil, rare, and then uncommon legend. I like that the some of the legends are uncommon, so that it, it's not you know exceedingly hard for me to get them all. Karametra's blessing is in the foil. Nadir Kraken is the rare. Is there a higher density of foils? Let's go around. I haven't looked at the back to see what. There's another Dalakos. I haven't looked at the back to check the odds versus previous. Because on the pack, somewhere in all, all, all this legalese, um, one rare mythic, three uncommon, ten common, and one basic land cards. Full card of any rarity replaces a common. One out of every three boosters. Do you see that? That's... that's uh, Planeswalker God and Demigod cards may have alternate frames. Huh. One out of every three packs? That's not bad. This is Ephemia, a Daxos with the treatment, and a Lyris Enraptured. That's a decent pack. We have Nyx Lotus. All the all the devotion decks are gonna fight over which one gets the Lotus. I guess wh whichever one you know needs it the most. Probably not the green one. <laughs> we have Atris, and that's it for that one. No special uncommons. Uh, Nessie and Boar's foil. Rare. That's two foil rares in this box. I guess that's, you know, going to happen sometimes, but it's pretty sweet when it does. Temple of Deceit is the rare. Uh, Timurit is an uncommon. And that's what I call uh, win on that pack. Uh, we have Temple of Enlightenment is the rare in that one. Ox of Ar Argonos. Yeah, I think this might do something as well. Uh, dredge players are really looking at this card. I don't know. I haven't done tribal oxes yet. So, or oxen, I guess it would be. That's Erebos's Intervention, a.k.a. Heliod Killer. Uh, what, we got four packs left. 
We got, oh, <laughs> it's so pretty. A foil treatmented Renata. I, the sad part is I think I traded for a pre-release. No, I traded for a pre-release Spider. Labyrinth, again. No way! Elspeth, son's nemesis? In a uh, full art? Wow. That's, uh... That's really kind of beautiful. Wow. I mean, wow. Hmm. I don't own any of the full art, stretch art, whatever they're called. Extended, no borderless. Borderless, I guess is what that would be. Uh, Temple of Abandon. Daxos is an uncommon. And our last pack. Let's see what we got here. I'm really happy with this one. Uh, Woe Strider. Feel real bad for that goat. And Aleros is an uncommon. And that is it for box number two. Uh, oh, oh, that's uh, I say box number two. That's kind of kind of the last box I, I normally do. I'll um, I'll open. I think tomorrow's video. I've I've got to the Planeswalker decks. Uh, sure, why not? Because I think that's the last time we're going to get them. From now on, they're being replaced with Commander decks. So, uh, and I'll show what I pulled with pre-release. So. That's what I've got for today. That's box number two. I appreciate y'all watching. Um, is this about normal? I mean, are y'all pulling like this? So, anyway, I appreciate you watching. Uh, y'all let me know what you think, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow.